in 2024, my speaking is going down. Perhaps it has something to do with the new trial questions. I have a lot of doubts with respect to PTE speaking. Well, if you belong to this category, then trust me, today's video is that video, which gives you proof of those people who have got 90 out of 90 in this new year with all the working techniques as far as the PTE speaking is concerned. Make sure you watch the video till the end. Hey everybody, this is Nakul from Skills PT Academic. Really hope everybody is doing fantastic. I'm back with at another power packed super awesome video on PT speaking, the working techniques, all new tips for a perfect 90 out of 90 and what effect does these two trial questions have on the speaking score. Before we get into the video, if you're not subscribed to this channel, kindly click on the subscribe button and anytime you need online assistance, it's a paid assistance, you can WhatsApp us to the number appearing at the bottom of the screen. I'll be there, we will be there to help you, guide you in the right direction. All right, without further delay, let me just share my screen, PT speaking, all new tips for the 90 out of 90 in 2024. How about the new question types? Start with all the new tips, the working tips for now and then we will address the new question types um, as to how to answer. Well, those who are wondering what are these new, uh, you know, I mean the question types, um, December mid they started introducing this new trial questions for some researching purpose. In any way, those trial questions will not be scored. They can come in any order. They can come in the beginning, middle, towards the end. Two new question types may come, may not come, but mostly people are getting them. Uh, one of them is to respond to a situation. They're going to give you a situation. You have to talk by responding to it. Other is to summarize something like summarize spoken text. Here, three to four people will talk. You need to speak and summarize it. These are the new question types. Very clearly on the top, it will be highlighted like read aloud, repeat sentence, describe image, new question type, respond to a situation, summarize the audio, something like this. Newly added question types will be marked. You will understand by looking at, by, you know, I mean, the reading, the heading, you would know. That these are the new question types, no need to worry. In the end, we will take up the scenarios um, as to should you skip it, should you speak and all those things. All right, so let's talk about all new techniques, the working types for a perfect 90 out of 90. We have Gautaman who has got 90 overall like this lot of students. What they have followed, first thing first, read aloud. Fluency needs to be mastered. What is this fluency? Fluency doesn't mean that you speak without taking the breaths. The brains of modern humans are organized differently and take longer to grow and make your market. No, not required. Not required. Am I doing it right now? No. I'm just talking to you naturally. Whenever I want to breathe, I breathe, but I continue quickly. I'll not give a lot of pauses. I'll show you a small scenario uh, with an example on how the fluency can be improved. Second thing is skip the difficult words. Yes, you can skip the difficult word. Will this cost any marks towards my reading? Because read aloud contributes 30, 33 or 35 marks towards your speaking and reading both. So if you skip some difficult words, will my reading go down? No. If you speak those difficult words and make mistakes and fumble, hesitate and whatnot, then your reading goes down. So you can skip how many words? Now don't tell me, you know, you know, like can I skip some 50, 60 words or all the words? No, at least some four to five words, six, seven words. Definitely you can skip, uh, still you will get a very good score, same score 90, speaking and reading is possible. This is working. One line I would recommend people not to use it. Uh, the scores could be so surprising. Even in official mock tests, we have seen people using one line and getting low scores. So avoid using it. Speak full, wherever you want to you know, skip the difficult words, you can do so without any problem. No intonations. Singing, avoid singing, try to be natural. I'm not singing right now, I'm just talking to you naturally, in a very natural way, isn't it? And my, my goal is to convey the message. So same way, in the exam, your goal, your aim has to be to convey the message to the software. No intonations, natural speed, no faster. Someone will tell you, I spoke really fast, I got 90, check his reading score. So don't go fast. You may increase your fluency marks, but software will not be able to interpret every word that you speak. Speak in a natural tone. Relax and just speak naturally. Just enjoy this module, man. Enjoy speaking, that's it. You worry a lot, that's where marks go down. I'm going to give you a small, uh, you know, with a small paragraph, how to speak in 2024 to get that full marks from read aloud towards your speaking and reading. And trust me, I have not looked into this paragraph before. 
in the ever evolving landscape of technology machines have become indispensable companions in our daily lives these mechanical marvels born out of human ingenuity and innovation are the driving force behind the modern era's rapid progress that 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 i'm giving pauses for a comma full stop natural i'm giving the small ideal ample pause and then picking it up it's like you're going in a motorbike or a car there is a speed breaker you will not completely stop the vehicle isn't it i'll just reduce the speed once it takes it off immediately again you will increase the speed same way here it should be very natural as and when required you pause as and when required did i give intonation no well i could have skipped few words let me just show you the same version by skipping at least 5 6 words oh, this is so difficult for me i'll skip it this word i don't have any clue this word also i don't have any clue this is so difficult word this i don't know let's say this many words i've skipped now the task is i need to speak without giving those pauses for these words that i'm skipping let's start in the landscape of technology machines have become in our daily lives these mechanical marvels born out of human and innovation are the driving force behind the modern rapid progress and still will get 100% i'll get 100% i'll get full marks but what people do in the landscape of technology machines have become in 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 our daily lives these mechanical marvels born out of hu human and innovation are the driving force behind the mo modern rap rapid progress this is going to be zero you will get very low score 45 speaking 50 speaking if this happens to be the same case same scenario for the rest of the questions it's very very um simple you just speak in a way the software listens and says hey boss i understood you don't make the software say hey boss i'm getting fully confused i don't know what language you're speaking with just getting it right it's as simple as that let's quickly move on to the second one that's all the read aloud is repeat sentence fluency needs to be mastered so when you practice you practice for fluency but what mr butterball or like any other person practices for the practice for content remember content is not a priority here even to get good marks towards your listening repeat sentence is an integrated module contributes marks towards your speaking and listening both 30 marks minimum it contributes total 60 30 to speaking 30 to listening so what people think i need to give let's say there are 12 words in the audio in order to get full marks to the listening i need to give all 12 words correctly no not required you give seven words correctly you still will get full marks where are you going to lose marks if your fluency has a problem speak like the speaker speaker is going at 40 km per hour let me also go at 40 km per hour oh speaker is applying a brake here let me also apply a brake here means pauses speaker is going in ferrari i am going in my normal car it's still fine you don't have to buy a ferrari you can go in your own accent hope you are getting it don't have to change the car but maintain the speed okay ferrari goes at 200 km per second nakul or per hour whatever <laughs> my car doesn't no here the ferrari will go at a natural speed normal speed 40 50 only speak the way the speaker speaks accent need not be you know copied content 50 60% if it is matching more than enough meaning you listen less speak less my capacity is seven words then listen to seven words don't listen to nine words and try to speak seven words that's where the problem starts avoid using generic phrases in the end so i have seen people doing this let's say the audio is please come to the next seminar properly prepared else you're going to make a big zero in your essay this is the audio person says please come to seminar i love you 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 i don't do all these things man please your listening will be gone case avoid using such even if you want 50 i don't suggest people doing this maybe you can speak please come to the next seminar prepared and click next speak 50% that is enough the more you speak the more mistakes you end up making remember this describe image here the fluency needs to be mastered meaning hold on meaning you need to have the same speed as the read aloud in the read aloud i go at let's say 40 km per second per hour rather describe image i already know the template so let me go very fast no it will not work i'm telling you read aloud they are learning a lot about you the rest of the thing they just match against your read aloud speed so you need to go in the describe image and read a lecture the same speed in the same speed as you spoke the read aloud 
again in 2024 probably Pearson is not giving much preference to this still since 2017 uh, do not have to worry. That means any template would do um, the template which has maximum minimum keywords or the template which does not have maximum minimum no keywords generic template anything will do. You can check the link in the description all the templates have been shared you can use them without a shallow of the doubt. Whether you give keyword or not it is not going to make a difference what makes a difference is the fluency. 20, 25 second is enough any template would do. And when you speak, make sure you speak naturally. The given image represents a beautiful image. There must have been a popular debate about the information given in the image whether it is true or false. But the information given in the image appears to be true. From the image it is clear the topic given is that 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 normal speed what, what people end up doing. In the read aloud they go slow. The brains of modern humans are organized differently and take longer to grow and mature. Describe image. The given image presents a beautiful image. There must have been a popular debate. There are marks gone. I am telling you you will not get the marks. Remember whatever you followed in read aloud the same thing needs to be followed even in describe image and written lecture as well. 20, 25 second more than enough written lecture fluency needs to be mastered. What is fluency or speak like the way you did in the read aloud content for a 79 or 65 I would always recommend people using phrases because let us say you are giving keyword and that word software is unable to interpret because of some of the pronunciation issues. Then content gone case no listening will go down rather if instead rather instead if you go with a small phrase which has 3 to 4 words you spoke 4 words in one phrase like that you repeated 4 times that means some 16 8 to 18 or 20 words you have spoken out of that there is a very high possibility software understands at least 14 15 words listening easily go up remember about using keywords try using phrases check out my detailed lecture video uh, you will understand how to write phrases and this end up speaking grammar is not important here you do not have to fit your lines into the template and make sense nothing is required you just have to speak for a 50 plus I would recommend use keywords it is not that important but for 65 and 79 use phrases 25 to 30 second is ideal do not have to speak a lot. The more you speak the more mistakes you make especially for an audio of less than 30 second length let us say you were able to write only 2 phrases not more than that because audio length is so small you are writing and audio ended. Now you repeat the content there are 5 lines in the template first line of the template the lecture gives the important key points and the relevant information about and you write sorry speak whatever you have written. Second line of the template in the beginning the speaker told about you speak whatever you have written third line of the template later the speaker explain the importance of now nothing has been written you repeat the first line content fourth line second line content fifth line first line content you have written only two sentences first line first sentence second line second sentence third line first sentence fourth line second sentence fifth line first sentence just repeat them if you do not have enough content well listening one two marks you may lose but speaking will definitely be 90. Which template to use use templates that have lengthy sentences the speaker said you can use I am not against it no templates will give you the marks what gives you mark is fluency. But template should be designed in a way that helps you get that fluency right. The speaker said is not in any way contributing marks to the fluency. Now you need to speak a lengthy sentence to tell the software that you are being fluent. That is difficult task. What if the template itself gives you that flexibility and adds that benefit of giving you fluency. Then it would be more easy for you. Well you can use any template but lengthy sentences template. This template that has length the lecture gives the important key points and the relevant information about that 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 automatically gives you fluency marks give it a thought give it a thought give it a thought. All right answer short question or a priority for 79, 64 or 50 plus whatever it is do not have to pay someone for the repeated answer short question question bank <laughs> someone else is making money because of our stupidity. I also thought the same when I was preparing for PT just like you all in 2017, 2018. It is not a priority even if you skip it you will get the same marks 90 or whatever your performance for the rest of the modules. You know the answer you tell the answer if you do not know the answer repeat the question or speak something relevant to the question and click next it is not a priority ok. Two new question types should I really answer them 
I think I skipped it. That's the reason I think I got low scores. No, guys. Well, if you really think so, then just speak. <laughs> then again, people think I spoke probably I made mistakes, so I got low score. You will get low score because you're making mistakes in read aloud, repeat sentence, describe image, write a lecture, not in here. One who is smart enough will accept it and work towards it and get 90 overall in the next attempt. One who is not, who is very adamant, I know everything because of this only I have done really good, keeps giving exam again, keeps giving exam again, makes the same mistake. He will not get the score. These two no question types in any way will not give you marks. We have seen people skipping them and get 90. We have seen people speaking those modules and get 90, perfectly speaking and we have seen some of the students attempting them with a lot of mistakes and still got 90. With this confidence, I am telling you, you can just skip it or do whatever you want. It is not going to affect in any way. The back end code at um, the Pearson end is working properly. Earlier I had 90, now I am getting less. Is this because of this? No, it is not because of this. It could be because of the pitch issue. But before that, I want to tell you something. Two new question types. Respond to a situation and summarize the audio. You can just skip them. But if you really want to speak, you can speak. Check the link in the description. There is a video that we have shared long time back on how to answer this using some templates. Um, well, if you really want, you go there. But my suggestion, just skip them. But yes, there are some people with a good intention of helping Pearson to uh, you know, get the right data and process them. Then please do, please attempt in your own way, but don't think that or don't assume that I skipped it or I attempted and made mistakes because of that my speaking is slow. It will not be. Um, you can trust my words. All right, I did everything and still my marks is low. It's 100 percent, 10 percent pitch issue problem. So, you've seen people getting low scores, sometimes 90 sometimes 65. All this can be pitch issue when you have pitch issue. It suggested you have for a male 150 around 145 to 150 or 160 to be on the safer side. You can download voice pitch. I am very sorry I should have written it here. Analyzer in the Android phone or if you are using um, iPhone you can use voice tools guys any of this app you can use and just click record in the app and speak you will be able to see your pitch. It should be 150 and above for a guy. If it is 120, if at all you are speaking 90, do not worry. But if your reading is never going up, then you need to increase the pitch. A person with 120 from my experience will never have, will never have speaking 90, usually 99 percent of the times. If it is 80, 100, then it is time you increase the pitch. The two ways of increasing the pitch, one is to speak louder, very loud something like, well, I do not want to shout now, but you can assume, you know, the 2x volume of this version. The brains of modern humans are organized 2x volume of this version, double the times. That way you can increase the pitch to 160, 140, 150. Avoid it, you will not get the scores, words will not be clearer, software will say, boss, I am getting confused. Do not do that. And others also will be affected who are sitting right next to you. Okay. So, second way of doing it is thinning the tone. The brains of modern humans. The brains of modern humans, not like a girl, but sharp tone and software loves the sharp tone voices. Trust me on this. That is the reason we often see female candidate getting 90 most of the times easily. That is the first thing. Second thing, let us say you are a female and you followed everything, but still speaking is less. Check the pitch. If it is 160, 150, some females will have a thicker tone. If that is the case, then you need to thin it further and get it to 180 or 200, 250, 240, 220, 200 is all ideal. My, my, my pitch is 220, I think that is the reason I got low score. No, you are making some other mistakes which you are not able to identify at the time, at the moment. But let us say it is 310. If it is very thin, then also software will not be able to understand. You need to reverse the procedure. For a male, he needs to thin it. For a female, she needs to thicken it if it is going beyond 300. This is the ideal one. After doing this also, if your scores are not improving, a join us man, we will fix it. Speaking is actually very easy. I think that is all for today. I really hope I have made an informative content about speaking. If you are struggling in speaking, then this is the video for you. If you like the video, do leave a comment with a valuable suggestion. Um, we would love to hear from you all. And if you like the video, leave your appreciation with a thumbs up. Do subscribe and hit like. 
button if you really like the video and this channel and anytime you need online assistance you can whatsapp us to the number appearing at the bottom of the screen we will help you in the right way this is nakul by the way n a k u l nakul signing off from skills pt soon we will be back till then take care bye bye